Hello, hello, boys and girls. This is Underseal, of course, and welcome to some Battlefield 3 gameplay. We're gonna talk Battlefield 4 today. Oh, yes. I know I'm uploading this video a little bit late. It's Thursday. Yesterday, all the news released about Battlefield uh, 4, and I also want to point out that I'm playing on a custom server here. That's why the weapon setup is a little bit different than normal Gun Master, because I know a lot of you guys are gonna be asking about it in the comment section. I just want to spare you the time. So, Battlefield 4 was uh, announced, officially announced, of course we fucking knew it was gonna get, get released because Battlefield 3 was like, Battlefield 3 is the best multiplayer game out there, I mean, all credit to Call of Duty, all credit to Counter-Strike, but really Battlefield 3 is just so much better than all of them, I mean, I've enjoyed many all of these other games, but not as much as Battlefield 3, I have not sunk 1000 hours into Call of Duty and I have not sunk it into Medal of Honor, definitely, I definitely haven't sunk it into uh, Counter-Strike GO either, and uh, so it was uh, announced, officially announced um, in Stockholm, the capital of Sweden, and San Francisco, the capital of homosexuals, <laughs> no I'm just kidding, but the capital, not uh, even the capital, but uh, in San Francisco, uh, in America, fuck yeah, <laughs> and those two places had the release parties, or rather the announcement parties, or whatever you want to call it, uh, got to see some nice uh, screen, uh, screen savers, or, or screen dumps, or whatever you want to call them, and basically uh, print screens of... Uh, of the, the gameplay simply and we got to see a 17 minute long single player campaign video slash trailer because I don't know it, it it looked almost like a trailer but what do we know about the game the game is gonna be set in basically modern time this is our time right now plus or minus a couple of years uh, depending on how you want to look at it uh, because it doesn't seem to be futurist futuristic and it doesn't seem to be like taking place in the, the 90s or anything like that and there's gonna be Russians, Americans and Chinese this time so uh, from what I've heard we might be able to expect actually some uh, three-way action, <laughs> some threesome action here uh, actually some conquest mi maps might have uh, both Russians, Americans and Chinese duking it out together planet side style on one map but this is just rumors I have no clue but it's mostly gonna be like regular rush maps so it's just gonna have one defending team and one attacking team so either Russian and uh, Americans or Chinese and Americans or Russians and Chinese and so on and so on. Uh, and it's not gonna be using, uh, Battlefield 4 is not gonna be using the Frostbite 2 engine and it, they haven't said anything about it using the Frostbite 3 engine either uh, they've just said they're not gonna be using the Frostbite 2 engine and I gotta say from what I saw in the gameplay it looked fucking great remember now that gameplay is from Alpha build and Alpha means basically it's very very early in development it's kind of half done only when we're talking beta or beta depending on where in the world you live and how you say it uh, we're, we're talking about like 85 to 90 percent done game so when you actually get to play the beta you can pretty much know that that's how the game is gonna be not many things are gonna change but in the alpha a lot of things can change and the graphics already look fucking amazing to be honest uh, it, it looked actually way better than I thought it would in alpha so I'm very very stoked about that uh, we can also clearly see that the hood or the heads-up display seems to ha have a lot of information influence from Medal of Honor Warfighter and I don't know you guys be the judge if that's good or bad I, I rather think the hood in Medal of Honor was pretty good even though Medal of Honor itself wasn't very good something else that makes me extremely happy Panda is that suppression seems to be nerfed in the game at least in single player in the single player campaign you can clearly see that the suppression was way lower than it actually is in multiplayer battlefield 3 so that makes me very very happy and the sun has also been nerfed from what I can see in the multiplayer trailer it is way less powerful than usual so I'm very 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 happy about that as well and uh, beta access this is the important stuff that everyone want to know about uh, beta access will be given given to everyone who pre-orders Battlefield 4 Digital Deluxe Edition. Uh, it's gonna be also given to all guys like myself that have Battlefield 3 Premium or that 
everyone that owns Battle of, or Medal of Honor Warfighter is also gonna get beta access. The beta is gonna come in fall of 2013, so this year, so it's basically gonna be exactly like Battlefield 3 was 2011, and uh, it's gonna be a beta around August there, somewhere around, and then the real game is probably gonna be released in September, maybe October, November, around there basically, before Christmas, a couple of months before Christmas, and there's gonna be nine maps at the at the start of the, the release, and uh, PC, Xbox 720, and PlayStation 4 players are gonna get 64 player maps, and uh, it's gonna be 24 player maps for PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360. So basically, don't buy Battlefield 4 if you got Xbox or PlayStation, buy a PC. Trust me, Battlefield, I know I sound like a battle, a freaking PC monster race guy right now, but Battlefield is so much more fun on PC. I mean, Call of Duty is more fun on PC, but it's not even close to like the difference between Battlefield on PC and Battlefield on console. So trust me guys on this, buy a new PC instead of buying that new console you might be thinking about because it's gonna give you a lot more for your money and a lot more enjoyment, especially when it comes to Battlefield 4. So as usual, thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.